My name's Ostmark, but I guess my story begins with my old man Hesse. He went into exile from Rainwater, freely, before they'd have reason to cast him out. It was a matter of beliefs, he says. My dad never spoke much about how or why, but he'd come to believe that the goddess of old was no goddess at all. Mighty and fell, but the work of man. Says he kept this to himself, but chose to leave ere the shamans found out. Mama, she was more of the traditional type. Darina didn't think much of Dad's ideas, but she'd always say, A woman keeps to a man, no matter how crazy he gets. And so she did. When Dad went south, Ma was there along with him. That's where I grew up, in their little homestead. The tales of Europa from Mama, stories of the greatness of man from Dad. He tried to teach me in the ways of the land, but I never really picked it up. Growing up without any other kids, I never got into trouble. Didn't learn to fight. On the other hand, I had to take care of my own fun. So I taught myself a trick or two. It was a grey day when Ma died. Dad blamed himself a lot. Me? I don't want to talk about that. What matters is, one day the old man said that I should go. He said he needed time alone, without me reminding him of Darina. He said I'd needed to find my place in the world anyway. Said he'd nothing left he could teach me. Said he'd be fine. So would I. I wandered for a while. Made a bit of a living by bringing joy to people's lives on a better day. By taking their unwashed goods on a worse day. Going hungry or foraging on the worst ones. On one of those worst days, far away from the last welcoming home, I was trying to spare some fish in the great water. One of the rocky spots, where fish like to hide. I've no idea how I left my guard down, but the tide came in. One moment I'm getting ready to thrust, the next I'm on my knees with a huge wave crashing over my back. Then on the back flow it threw me back, filled my mouth and nose, bashed my head against a rock. So there I was, drifting out to the open and into the dark. Suddenly something grabs me by my shoulder yanks me right out of the water. What I caught sight of was a bear of a man, hairy, large, and strong. Didn't say much. Wasn't really the time for that sort of thing. He hauled me to the dry and loved me out. I didn't see what became of him. One moment he's there following me out. The next he's gone. Nothing but the waves and the wind. Next moment I wink out. When I come back, there were some folk around me, said they were looking for the medicine man. I told him I'd just seen the face of my own demise and wouldn't mind a bit of patching up myself. Told him what had happened. We put heads and tails together and gathered it had been their man that saved me. Now I may not be the most respectable or reputable man in the waste, but Ma didn't raise me to be ungrateful. And they had the air of good people. I said they were a good man down so I'd do my best to help them prosper, until such a time I'd feel my debt were paid. That time ain't come yet. <laughs>